Now so those, who are your friends and who are your enemies? Well, I've learned a lot, I have to tell you. Um, I mean, part of the book, we're gonna, I'm going to be writing a book. I don't know why I'm even on the show, except we want to get you good ratings. I said to Faith... <laughs> I said to Faith, we're going to get you some huh? major, major ratings. And you are. You're going to get big ratings. Tell the what rest of the do? story, though. I know. I saw yeah, you at the celeb know, Celebrity Chef I dinner did. here oh. in New York. And what a kiss. You, you kissed me on the lips in front of the paparazzi, and I said, that'll cost you. I'm uh, booking you on the show. I know. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> True story, the correct? The kiss was so good, and it was so open and nice. She is a fabulous woman. And I so open and story. nice. What and her that? husband, her husband is a handsome devil, I'll tell you. He's a good guy. But I think he had his back turned at the time. But yes. um, so we had a good time. That was the man who is now president of the United States uh, bragging in 1992 to a studio audience about the nice open kiss. I think he means open mouthed kiss uh, that he unexpectedly planted on a married woman while her husband's back was turned. Uh, that interview aired on a syndicated daytime talk show called A Closer Look that was hosted by a longtime news anchor and reporter named Faith Daniels. Um, that back and forth we just aired, that bit about Trump sneaking up on Faith Daniels and kissing her when she least expected it, um, that was not a one-off sort of creepy comment in an otherwise run-of-the-mill interview. That's basically what the whole thing was like. You are seen in the company of lots of beautiful women, Donald. I like beautiful women. You're very beautiful. This is really a beautiful woman. <laughs> I really do sleep well, and I, I think, you know, You don't some lie people, awake at night and chew no, your nails and worry about this. No, I really don't. And some people, some people have an ability that they really don't worry about things too much. I would say that I have that ability. If I did, I probably would have been in a corner with my thumb in my mouth and just going, you know, mommy, take me home. I want to go home. Well, you certainly because, aren't doing that. We saw evidence of that. No, I, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> Somebody else's thumb in my mouth. Could you ever see yourself pulling a Perot? Uh, I don't necessarily think so. I mean, I'm so controversial. I love beautiful women. I love going out with beautiful women, and I love women in general. And people would say, oh, that's a horrible thing. You know, somebody would say, what would they say if you said you love women? I'd say, I, I agree. But I love almost, women. In your case, I mean, we've already gone through all the scandals. There'd be nothing left to uncover, yeah. haven't we? I mean... Yeah. Would you like to ask the Donald? Yes. Um, if you could have your choice, who would be the one person you'd date? Wow. Um, or who are the three about, most beautiful women in the world? Well, how about Lady Di? That would be an interesting one. She's going to be available. For you. She's married. Huh? Why not? That would be it? That's your choice? Look around. What kind no, of woman do you choice. like? I think my choice might be you. Look at the legs on her. Boy. <laughs> I think it would be safe that you take beauty over brains. No, 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 no. I, I like beauty coupled with brains. I do like, I mean, I prefer a beautiful woman to a non-beautiful woman, and I know that's discriminatory. I know people say how horrible. He's a horrible human being to say that. But I'll tell you what, men, raise your hands. Does anybody disagree with me? Does anybody disagree with me? Yeah, I know that's discriminatory. Come on, men. Uh, in the lead up to that interview, uh, the team at A Closer Look actually sent one of their uh, camera crews to Mar-a-Lago to shoot a profile piece on Trump that preceded that interview, uh, showing, uh, showcasing his, his life as a newly divorced man, having just split from his wife, Ivana. Uh, in the footage, a lot of the women here are apparently uh, were cheerleaders for the Buffalo Bills. It uh, turns out they were in town for a game against the Miami Dolphins. Uh, Trump is the host of the party. There's footage of him at one point uh, grabbing one woman by her waist uh, and then uh, later patting her on the rear end. Um, but one of the reasons this footage is appearing now, one of the reasons that MSNBC uh, dug it up all these years later is because uh, one of the guests who can be seen in this footage is Jeffrey Epstein. Um, the same Jeffrey Epstein who just this past week was charged on uh, charged in federal court on, on child sex trafficking charges. That's Epstein there in the jean shirt. In this newly uncovered tape, uh, Trump is seen personally welcoming Epstein and some other guests as they arrive at the party. Uh, later, Trump and Epstein are seen on camera uh, sort of gawking at the women on the dance floor. Trump appears to tell Jeffrey Epstein, look at her back there, she's hot. Uh, then thereafter, Trump whispers something into Epstein's ear that causes Epstein to, to double over in laughter while they keep looking at the women. I mean, it would be one thing if there was just this one newly rediscovered piece of tape showing our current president ogling women with a man who is now a convicted sex offender who's on trial on very serious sex trafficking charges. Um, but there is more. And if you're wondering if the president's recent ramp up of his racist provocation stuff that he's been doing these last few days might at all be driven by the fact that Epstein was just arrested and his case is now sort of rapidly exploding, 
it is worth understanding the president's standing in the Epstein matter, and we have more on that next. Stay with us. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.